When I first noticed that I had a bump in my leg, I initially thought that it was a bug bite or some kind of cyst. So I ended up going to the doctor after waiting for several months and noticing that it got larger. We didn't do much with it for a little, a little while until I noticed that it started changing and it grew larger and it started changing colors. Um, so at that point we saw another doctor, my primary care physician, who said, you know, it's at the point where it's large enough where we're going to want to get that taken out or we're going to want to get it looked at by somebody. The doctor came to me and he held my hand and he explained to me that what I had was called a leiomyosarcoma, not a cyst. It wasn't until the car ride home that it hit me that it was cancer. Sarcoma is a cancer that is very, very rare. It's very aggressive. It's not always responsive to chemotherapy. My initial reaction was more of shock and it was more of thinking in the short term of what am I going to do with school? Am I going to be okay? You know, what's going to happen next? So this first occurred in July of 2014 when I got the surgery done. Um, that was right in between my senior year and the junior year prior. If I didn't take the course that I took during my treatments, during um, the surgeries and the hospital stays, I would have been a whole year out. I graduated one semester late. Albany Med, it allowed me the space to be able to just sit down and study and they they treated me like a student too. It was I didn't just feel like I was a patient there. They would come in and the nurses were incredible. The nurses would come in and they would ask me about my class. The nurses made me very welcome. It was important to me that I stay with Hannah during her hospitalizations. Both Dr. DiCaprio and Dr. Patel, as well as the residents, uh, provided not just expert care, but a very caring and supportive attitude, which is extremely important. Prior to my diagnosis, I took a lot of dance courses. I've danced throughout my life. Um, so getting back, especially with the cancer being in my leg, it was difficult to not only get back to walking again, but to get back to dancing was a struggle. So I was able to take dance classes when I got back and I was able to start traveling again and going hiking. I feel as this year's Sarcoma Strong honoree, just completely honored to be able to have this opportunity to be able to share my story and to fundraise and raise the awareness to help others. So every year at the run that we have the 5K, they do, they take in their donations and those donations go to the Musculoskeletal Tumor Society. To be able to go and help towards this research grant has been great. This has been something that means a lot to me. It's very close to me. There's not enough words to thank Albany Med and Dr. DiCaprio for what they've done, but they have really just gone above and beyond for me. I am Hannah Moyer and I am Sarcoma Strong.